Oh. This is Keith Lundquist from Down Under Grove, Illinois. We wanted to respond to your request of the word success, or what does success mean to um, Keith? I, be I believe that you are truly successful. Uh, first of all, I don't have the balls to do what you do. Cojones? Cojones, yeah. Um, I, I don't have them. I really, you know, they're, they're here somewhere. But, uh... Um, Speak your mind. It's the resident. Go ahead. I know. Well, gosh, you're putting me on the bubble, man. No, but I do love what you do. And uh, what does Tagore say about success? Better yet, let's try Maha Gandhi. Wait, what did Hitler say about success? Not, not to offend you if you're Jewish, but what? What did? Uh, oh, Einstein. What is the uh, theory of relativity? I believe you're successful. I'll say that. Uh, um, a I resident? Mean, successful in what? Um, in getting your stuff out on YouTube. Oh, well, that's easy. That's a couple of clicks and a dot. Yeah, I understand that, but you know. But it is a great format, though. All of my favorite writers have taken, well, they, they've taken half their lives to get printed. And most of them didn't enjoy the success at all, or they did enjoy the success for a moment of their life. Didn't Hemingway, like. What oh, do do? hunt the, the yellow leaf. Yeah, whatever. Didn't he like hang himself and then shoot himself? Everybody hangs themselves or shoots themselves with something. I think he did both. What is it, cordon bleu or is it tuna? Either way, it's gonna kill you. Yeah, tomato, tomato, and tomato, tomato. Right. Hot sauce, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise. Right. Salsa. Right. Um. I suppose you only respond to more, like intelligent responses to your reposes, so we're trying to enact in an, an articulate way that would spark your interest in making collaboration of videos between the two of us and you. Uh, that's never going to fucking no, happen. I know, because we're never going to go to the East Coast again, because the blue crab is going extinct. Yeah. A friend of mine got murdered in Philadelphia. Oh, yeah, man. Apple Hill, man. Apple Apple Hill. Chapel Hill, too. Holy shy. <laughs> Man, that's the first place I ever had a pizza that was called a white pizza in my entire life. I've never heard of the word white pizza. I've never heard of that either. Like in Chicago, they don't name anything white, dude. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> if you bother. did... Why bother? If you did, they, they would call it like what Crayola did with their flesh-colored crayon. They call it peach now. Okay, you know, it just doesn't kind of work here. <laughs> yeah, it just doesn't... <laughs> Too many plastic factories, I think. Um, Jesse Jackson and Al Sharpton would be all over this place. We tried to do stuff like that. Yeah, for sure. Um, but to response, or to re too. shall I say, a, a retraction or a reaction towards your video success? Um, a success is whatever you make it, really. It's nothing but a dream. Well, it's whatever you want it to be. Giving my father a kidney was success to me. Right, exactly. A succession um, of succession of what? Me, me putting out a record was a, <clears throat> a success. What is the root word of success? Suck. S. Suck ass? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> it could be. It could be, yeah, totally. It could be. This is the avant-garde speeches from Keith Lundquist. How you do? And Harry Overstreet. It's really easy to spell. Over street. Yeah, and you can Google him. You can Google all you like. That's right, you'll never mm. find him. You'll never find me. <laughs> <laughs> but he's giving you fucking the real deal right there. But however, if you ever read any books by Harry A. Allen, or it's Harry Allen Overstreet, it's a great sociologist, it's a fantastic socialist. You know, perfect person. Oh, she listened. She doesn't really? want to hear that. No, she doesn't want to hear about Socialism. that. Socialism. Ah. Yeah, come on, in New York, they're all social. There's like one toilet for 100,000 people. That is pretty damn social. <laughs> I'm not going to lick that one. No, me either. Yeah. So, Keith would like to say something to you that has nothing to do with your gender. What, the lover? He loves your mind. Yeah. Not the shadow of your figure. That has nothing to do with the figure. The face is cute. But when it comes right down to it, no, seriously, it's the mind. Where I work, I like where the, I work, 
You should read the notes from these middle school children. Oh my God, hear them. Like, I have this office, this closet, I call it my this office. This is not kiddie porn, by the way. And I listen to these kids talk. And they're like 13, 12 years old. They act like they've been bangers and traders and um, oh. oil dealers their whole life. Mm -hmm. You know? Like, this one note that I found was really kind of cute, actually. She's like, I really love you, but if you only want to make out with me, I, I can't be with you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like... Oh my God, honey, you have nothing, no idea Wait, what's going on with that. How you get pregnant? You know? Yeah, you know, <laughs> like, <laughs> I mean, they had this party today. They ate a bunch of sugar and danced around, and I was hiding in my office, my office, and listening to their chatter. What, what I want to do, what I want to do, is put a recorder, and I want to record the conversations in the hallway between bells and really get down the lingo of this idea about texting. But texting in itself has become a language. Like, it's a language of texting, like LOL and all that stuff. Right. It's such a debauchery to me. Because I, I don't understand. I don't understand this modern language. And, yeah. You know? Because then you got to help them. It doesn't use any pretext. Or, like, it doesn't say, like, the car is red. It's like TRC, you know? And I'm like, what the hell does TRC mean? And what is LOL? Lots of laughs, right? I, I just learned right. that one. LOL. But I was like, lots of love. Laughing. Like I was like, lots of love or lots of laughs or right. what? You know, I, I don't know. I don't get it, man. I, I, L -M -A -O. But I think my ass off. Was it the same thing that Shakespeare was talking about when, you know, in one of my favorite plays he ever did? English is a fucking perversion, you know? Oh, that? I know, dude. But it's a perversion, come then, on. But... You can't stop it. No, yes, you can. No, you can't. Yes, you can. No, you can't. You can make them spell applause. Instead of like L M A. Apple L S, whatever. Or axe, or axes. How many axes do you need to make an act? <laughs> oh, now you're talking ubonics. Well, ubonically and, and text messaging, I think, are the same kind of genre, actually. In my mind, anyway. That's a shortcut. Yeah. That's why I'm trying to learn German. Ah, uh, Hamlet. What about him? <laughs> oh, Hamlet, throw down thy knightly shroud and accept thy king as thy uncle? That is pretty literal and pretty sane to me. Right, right, right. Yeah. Sit in the bottom no. Ah, uh, you can't. I don't think you can. You can. Wait. Uh, yo, nigga. <laughs> yo, yo, nigga. Ah, uh, wait. No, yo, niggas, um, ask your daddy as your unks. Um, I think they would say so to Throw down my nightly shroud. How can you say that nubonically? Throw down thy nightly shroud. So throw it'd be like, my, throw down throw thy down dark my, hoodie, right? My fucking, my fucking coat. dark hoodie my trench, trench coat. coat. My yeah. trench coat. Throw down thy nightly trench coat. Oh, yeah. By the way, we're members of the right. trench coat mafia. Right. Throw down my nightly trench coat and accept thy lord instead of king. It'd be lord, right? Or gang. Gang. Is, gang, is gang, gang. Or crew. Or credo. See, it's, it's just completely confusing to me because crew, credo, crew. <laughs> <laughs> You know, it's like being a fucking goldfish in a fucking tank. You're going like this. What are they talking about? That's what I say about you fucking know? Shakespeare. Shakespeare is genius, dude. Maybe, but... Hamlet throw down my nightly shroud and accept thy king as thy uncle? <laughs> That's like, do you like cinnamon tasting toothpaste? Or do you like minty, wet, mean? fresh, green gum? I mean, what, 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 what? You want to fucking put a... 22 in your head or U.S. A politics. Except thy king is thy uncle. You know? That's your family. You know? The president should be speaking for you unilaterally. If the fucking president was my father, mm. I would take him on. All I'd have to hear is... Heineken. Fucking, the beer think, of champions. You think he can fucking take my ass? Mm. I'd be like, yes, I can. And I would. Henry Miller, you know... I mean, he says words like joyously, joyously, and 